like to introduce you a person, a very famous person, and his name is Nikola Tesla. Uh, Tesla, probably you think the name seems familiar, familiar. Yes, uh, we know the Tesla car, right? Electronic car. Um, Elon Musk, Elon Musk's company. Yes, actually, his company indeed named after this person. Nikola Tesla and um, Nick and um, Elon Musk confirmed that in uh, January 2017 uh, he said his company the car the logo uh, like a T uh, it's not just the fancy T yeah it's the uh, cross section model um, uh, he confirmed he named that uh, uh, his company and uh, after Nikola Tesla. So now you must be uh, know yeah how famous Nikola Tesla is was because even Elon Musk Elon Musk uh, admire him I mean uh, respect him. Um, Nikola Tesla was born in eighteen fifty six in July ten. And uh, he was a um, uh, Serbian America, American, and the the place he was born belonged to Austrian um, Austrian Empire at that time. Uh, yeah, it's a Croatia, uh, Croatia now uh, nowadays Croatia. Uh, yeah, he, uh, his um, homeland is uh, Serbian. Uh, in 1891, he went to America and uh, in the beginning worked for Edison, the famous inventor too. And then, uh, he, then he went out for him, uh, yeah, worked for himself, uh, got, uh, you know, found from a famous wealthy person. So he designed his famous um, alternating current, AC, uh, electricity supply system. Uh, which we are still using today. Uh, he he's, uh, he was not the only um, inventor that he invented seven hundred different things. Um, he got the idea of the no nowadays modern cell phone. Yes, next time when you look at your phone, you yeah, you you'd better think about the Tesla because hundred years ago he had this idea. Uh, about uh, you know people can talk uh, through the electricity and uh, yeah thousands of way people can talk can see each other that's a very advanced idea at that time and also uh, Nikola Tesla have a special relationship with the universe and uh, that's why uh, yeah in the beginning I uh, noticed him and uh, because the uh, he has uh, his uh, coat I read one of his quote says, "If you want to know the universe, uh, you better think about the vibration, frequency, uh, wave, um, things like that. Um, you know, it depends the, uh, the wavelength, um, uh, gravity, and uh, relative amount of the you know um, different." Uh, a wave and um, energy and uh, yeah his his quote is yeah if you wish to understand the universe you'd better think of energy a uh, vibration um and the uh, uh vibration energy and frequency anyway i admire him i respect him a lot and then uh, I lately know the status of him uh, in Niagara Falls. Uh, I went to Niagara Falls so many times, um, but it probably passed by. I didn't read <laughs> read the name. Recently, I went to pay my visit. Uh, I also shoot a video. You will see, yeah, uh, the one uh, the status in the um, uh, Niagara Falls, Canada side. There are another one on the uh, American side. Next time I, I will pay, yeah, pay a uh, uh, visit there too. 
um, I don't know why I, I was always I always drawn uh, to Niagara Falls and I don't know why uh, sometime you know and I go there take the gold train and if they are there's a long weekend so I take a go train go there um, you know walk around uh, see the falls and sitting there eat a lunch and come back and of course it's a falls that's impressive right and then the uh, uh, gardening flowers I love them over there and um, but uh, after I know uh, you know uh, Tesla's status there and uh, he had uh, you know a uh, close uh, relationship how to say with the uh, Negra Falls uh, so uh, I sort of understand um, probably that's uh, another reason why I was drawn there because he was there <laughs> mm. okay let's um, enough for me and uh, let's look at the uh, videos uh, one video is the uh, introduced introduction of him and uh, there are yeah other videos even movies yeah he's a person he's one of the person in the TV series uh, the man who built America uh, yeah like a log filler John Rock John B log filler uh, you know so many famous people yes you can uh, google it and then watch it if you are interested in that I just throw a thread uh, so yeah you can go from there thank you let's uh, have a look imagine a world without electricity radio neon lights integrated circuits remote control and radar could one human being really be behind all that? Nikola Tesla is one of the masterminds of the modern age, and he might be called the man who invented the 20th century. You are invited to come with us on a journey to discover his life, which is like a thriller about technology, money, and power. Nikola Tesla's most famous invention, the alternating current system, is to this day the most important energy transmission system in the world. The second industrial revolution was based on this invention. It made energy available everywhere. Night became day. Artificial lighting, evening entertainment, brightly lit cities were a sensation that everybody loved. Tesla is also one of the fathers of wireless. He was the first inventor who presented the transmission of electromagnetic waves publicly. Today, we call it radio. Tesla's vision was to tap into the energies of the universe and make them available to us. He experimented with the fourth state of matter, then called radiant energy. Today, it is called plasma. These are cosmic rays, or cosmic energies, whose shadows we can see in the colorful displays of the northern lights. Tesla envisioned the wireless power feed from space by the transmission of cosmic rays harvested via satellites. And his worldwide wireless system was designed for the transmission of any kind of wave to transmit information of all sorts and electrical energy to moving aircraft, electric cars, and railways, wirelessly fueled by a mysterious energy from the universe. Tesla made his way from immigrant to inventor of world fame. Then he was almost forgotten. So who was Nikola Tesla really? The magician of electricity? An exceptional scientist whose inventions made the second industrial revolution possible? Or just a mysterious loner? Tesla now is on his spiritual planet. He's a role model for all of us. He was a great genius. He
was a Tesla, a person who was born 100 years ago. And I always think uh, the example, uh, the power of example, or we can say the power of heroes um, um, the most influential uh, things for human being for this generation even next generation and so um, if we always uh, you know um, read the biographies or not the things of famous people I mean uh, who uh, did good for human being for the whole uh, society uh, you know and that's a good influence for us, right? Also, we also we know uh, how the universe works mm. uh, through their work. And I will talk about more in the future. I will, in, you know, uh, introduce more famous people, and then uh, how they related with the universal laws, and uh, how. Uh, you know, um, they influence uh, the society, uh, the whole world, and how the universe influenced them. Nikola Tesla said, uh, when he was 12, he saw the, the uh, Niagara Fall for the first time, and he said, someday I will build a wheel uh, behind it and then let it run and to generate power and he did it let's think about that and then to think how we can do uh, to you know uh, work for this society to contribute our part to this world okay that's uh, all for today uh, thank you for watching see you next time